I'm gonna try that again. One more time. Last last time. Um I'm gonna buy everything on sale. Um I say we get the shield. I may regret this. Kinda already regretting it. In a way. <laughs> Maybe I'll regret it even more. I don't know. But at least it got me a spike shield on the second round. That should be nice going against pretty much everything that's not a Reaper. Especially this guy. I think we lose this. Nope. GG's. Okay, we're going Poison Goober next round, which is great. I'm just gonna roll with this. <laughs> Poison Goobert wins games. I've learned that. I should probably pick up a broom. I think that's what I'm gonna do is just pick up a broom. We win this? Let's go. Good game. We got two left over. Some space would suffice. And a broom. Space and a broom. Uh, I'm just gonna go like... Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, we can't really use you. I'll take this, though. Double broom. Okay. It's a good thing I don't need accuracy for anything. Just stack the blind on me, why don't you? While I heal. Because my goober is awesome. And I think I still lose. Yeah. <laughs> Now I got me a poison gooby. Let's see here. I don't think I have enough space. Yeah. Uh. Crap. I don't have enough space. No. I'll just use shield. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna just roll with this. Put the broom in there. Maybe poison. Maybe <laughs> just like three activators. Damn it! I should have went with the freaking shield. It would have helped against this person. Activate poison goobert. We need you. Let's go. Still win. Awesome. The power of the poison goobert. Unholy armor on sale. There's no way I could have put in the shield in there. There's no way. I kind of want to buy this holy armor. Turn into a dark armor. It's on sale. It's like one of those like why not? Situations, you know? I'm gonna do it. You know why? Because why not, you know? <laughs> it's like almost buy, I feel. Almost must buy. Almost. I feel like with this build is good because corrupted armor is just nice to have. But we do need the Corrupted Crystal for the Dark Scythe. Saber. Dark Saber. So, yeah. <laughs> do we win? Do we win these? Extra armor. Extra region. Extra poisonage. I think we do. Poison Goobert. Carries games. <laughs> GG's. Uh. <laughs> um, I'll take the fanny pack. Do I need it? Stone helmet. Yeah. On a poison build? I mean, 
to kill bills or your was your enemy well, I was going to go with glowing crown actually maybe at least the stone uh, skin potion will insta proc because of the honey armor there's that that'll be good works too yeah but then again am I going to be able to insta proc the crown Utilizing cauldron with dark saber eating mana. Hmm. Don't know. We win. I'm pretty pretty sure. <laughs> GGS. Hey, saving you for the dark sight, a saber. Put you there. Actually, wait, no, I don't. Yes, I do. For the D plus inflicted. Oh, next round we get the cauldron. I'm gonna need space for that. <laughs> Crap. Oh wait, the cauldron. We could just upgrade the potions. So maybe I shouldn't do that combination. This is potion upgrade. It's free. <laughs> Buying all the pockets things you find is a good play, is it? I've never tried that before. I don't think I get this helmet. We need space. Golly. I can sell the spike shield, I guess. I don't think we like need it per se now. Do I get you? We'll get more armor that way. I'm gonna sell the spike shield. Is it even worth making this broom fast? I actually don't know. I feel like it could just be a little bit better making something else faster. What did I say about cauldron size? <laughs> At least it's a good activator. You know, there's that. It's got its benefits. It might be big, but it's useful. Are we going to beat the double axer? Let's see. I'm so glad I got this car up to crystal in the armor slot. I feel like it helps a, a decent bit. Let's go. We beat him. Good game. Upgrade. Yeah, I'm gonna just get this. Please give me a, a saber. Oh my god, please give me a lightsaber. Oh my god, please give me a lightsaber. Please. I kind of need it. You got Sun Armor in one of your Reaper runs, and it was pretty broken with Cauldron. Oh, because of the heat. Oh, that actually does sound pretty broken, actually. That's really cool. I didn't even think about that. Cauldron, uh, when you get the Sun item. You can find a Scythe 
What run were you rocking? Is it a poison run? This is interesting. Going magic staff on a reaper. Also went cauldron. Interesting. I could see the appeal though. Since cauldron gives you mana for the magic staff anyways. I could see the appeal right there. Do we lose? I think we lose. Nope. Almost. Let's go. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Um, I'm actually going to sell you just so I can double up on that real quick. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> Could have probably organized this a little bit better, but whoop, whoop. Unlock the armor. I don't want to. <laughs> I want to keep my corrupted crystal inside that slot, right? For the poison, the armor gain. You do want to? I understand because of the. Uh, uh, but the armor gain. Uh. Fine, I'll trust you. I understand because Dark Saber. Plus corrupted armor, the star slot, with the armor game plus the poison. Yeah, I understand. I understand the logic behind your choices. Kill this man. Thank you. Well, shit, we got another one anyway. <laughs> okay. What do we got? 13? I'm about to sell this garlic, bro. I'm gonna just sell the banana. I'm sell the banana. All right. Yo! Again? <laughs> Thanks, man. I appreciate that, bro. Thank you again for the, uh, for the raid. Thank you very, 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 very much. Very, 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 very much. There's gotta be a better way to set this up. What am I missing? A scythe or something? <laughs> right! Dark armor literally has everything Dark Saber build wants. Oh, I forgot it did the, the cleanse two debuffs and inflict them on your opponent. I literally forgot it did that. I'm gonna be honest. Completely forgot that that did that. <laughs> I was just I was just thinking about the protection, the 10% chance to protect your debuffs. I wasn't even thinking about the uh the extra infliction that it does when you get debuff and inflicts it on your opponent. I didn't even think about that part. This isn't looking great for us though. And we're out of stam. No. Kill this man. God damn it. Feels bad, man. So, do we just need stamina potions and dark scythe now? That's all we need, right? Basically. Hope you have a nice stream. Thank you. And thank you for the raid, as always. Oh, we need mana. Oh, wait, no, we get mana from the cauldron. Never mind. I'm gonna get this anyways. Get the banana. Just for the extra stam. Damn, I kind of got the <laughs> blueberry. I mean, I could just sell the blueberry <laughs> and get it. I'd feel bad doing that because I feel like it's going to be a waste of money. It's only one gold. We don't really need the blueberry, right? We get the we get mana from the cauldron, so I might as well just sell it anyways. One blueberry is good. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I did it anyways. 
Okay, on the bright side, he's only got one Molten Dagger and not like five. So that's good. Unlock Potion. Oh, crap. You're right. I didn't see that. <laughs> good call. Definitely did not see that. Good call. We can do this. So far, so good. Because of the blind. His hammer's missing. And now he's out of stamina. One more hit. Let's go. Let's go. Hey. Sir. Am I glad to see you. I'm about to start buying potions just to buy potions. Nah, that was way expensive. Nine gold, excuse me. Hey, you. Am I happy to see you too? Um. I feel like we need to or reorganize. Because I feel like we should try to make these proc as much as possible by putting the armors under them, right? Like, that's the smarter play. So I feel like we need to reorganize. So we can... Maybe do something like that instead. And move everything up by one. Maybe move Cauldron here. Uh, wait. Maybe not, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. Maybe so? Now we could do like that actually. And so we'll have like some slots down here that we can use. Um, even though that's empty, I don't like it being empty. I guess I could do that. And this? Still empty right there, but eh. I don't know how to set this up. I feel like the poison potion needs to be proc as many times as possible, and that's why I want to have the stone skin potions under the poison potions. I'm right on that, right? Or am I wrong on that? Cauldron size at play again. <laughs> Fucking cauldron hater. <laughs> I don't think that's bad. Let's see what happens here. Poison versus poison. Okay. But they got snake. But at least Corrupted Armor is going to help me with that, I guess. Ouch, 23. Please help. They could have way... They could have a way worse build. They could have done some crazy shit to us, I think. Okay, awesome. 50%. <laughs> Alright, let's get you. Alright, now this changes things up. This changes things now. This changes things. Drastically changes things. How in the world am I going to do this?
crap. Wait, no. This works, right? Why did that feel like that went way better than I thought it was going to? We're definitely running out of stamina now, which is unfortunate. So maybe we could just rely on poison to kill? <clears throat> I wonder if it's better to have the corrupted armor as an activator instead of the sword, just for the sake of stamina. I don't know. Because this is every three seconds. This is every 1.5, but I mean, we have enough fanny packs. We could organize this a little bit to move everything down by one and put another row up there. Move that as an activator for the goober and then just put the sword down here somewhere. That's a possibility. That's a lot of mana they're using. Jesus. But yeah, we definitely need more uh, potions. Oh, we start off with a lot of poison though. Oh, they hurt so much. Now we're out of stamina. Oh, no. We kept up with them until they started hurting us. And then we died. Should we just fish for, like... <laughs> I'd like to fish for stamina potions. I feel like that might be better. I'm gonna try it. Move everything down by one. And... You're gonna go up here. And then the sword is just gonna be like here. Instead. I don't know where to put you. I guess I can move you over. Oh, we need glowing crown. What the hell? Did we pass up a glowing crown? No still helmets. Yeah, I was just thinking about that too. We need a freaking glowing crown. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's not good. They look like they're gonna survive for a really long time. And there's that. We did manage to get a lot of poison on them, though. Which is great. Let's go! Um... Ooh. Did we get demonic... Did we get this? I feel like we do. Just because of these sheer amounts of everything well this proccing at the start of the game doesn't matter does it so realistically what we should do is that I believe or maybe we should try to proc the stamina potion because this yeah, this procs whenever they're at below 50. So maybe proccing the stamina potion is better right there. And then we could just do that. That's empty. Um, um, yeah. Oh, it's nutty. Okay. And maybe we should just do that. <laughs> I want a glowing crown. <laughs> Oof. That's a fucking great sword. OK, 
Okay. And then we should get our stamina. Another stamina, which is great. This is, oh my gosh. All right, bro. Maybe Berserker is too strong. <laughs> Maybe. Actually, no, I'm gonna get this for the stam. Can I get a stamina potion? Oh, there's a cap. <laughs> I guess we just get the stone cap. Opponent drops below 50% or you drop below 25. Consume this and steal 0.4 life for each debuff of your opponent. Ooh. Three seconds. Reduce opponent's healing. I should try to double proc this. There's nothing I can really use to make that happen. I don't think. I should nah, I'm just gonna keep it like this getting more of these would be fire though that's an interesting build what are they doing? They have a rapier, a freaking dark saber, a ruby chunk. They have a lot of everything. Sheesh. You just need a good build against Berserker. There are none. <laughs> They're too strong. And stone helmet. Please, should I just fish for a crown? I'm gonna fish for a crown. I found one, but now I'm broke. Oh, uh, we have so much money we have to get up. Uh, we could we could sell we could sell space. That's three, two, two. So that's four, that's nine. And that'll be twelve. say that's what we'll do oh oh shit holy items are our dark items i just now realized that was a thing all right this is the build we've got super poison inside a dark scythe with the gooby corrupted armor with double corrupted crystals a dark saber a little bit of potions and glowing crown is the icing on the cake honestly that's the icing on the cake for me. Oh, and we're going against like a really good ranger build with um, magic torch and double bow and arrow. Insta proccing the heart container, utilizing the leaf for that. He's got double freaking birdie on that. That shield is going to be annoying. Let's see what happens here. Where's my mana? There we go. I just need more of those manas. I need a crown proc very soon. Like very, very soon. Like very, 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 Oh no, this is not good. Okay, we still managed to win. Even without a crown proc. Okay, now I know that uh, <laughs> we're going to need a mana orb or at least some blueberries, preferably a mana orb. A mana orb right there would be great. It'd be on the savior. It'd be on the cauldron. Be great. And then we can get an actual crown proc. Either way, we still won even without it. Defeating a build like this. Granted, the crit chance wasn't 100%. Like an acorn caller would go so far here, but still. That was a pretty good game, though, in my opinion. That was fun. That was fun.